At City Utilities, the quality of our drinking water is our top priority, and we work hard every day to maintain these high standards. In fact, City Utilities has been recognized by the American Water Works Association over the last 24 years for excellence in water quality. New legislation from the Environmental Protection Agency and Missouri Department of Natural Resources requires water utilities across the country to identify the piping material of all water service lines, including both the utility-owned and the customer-owned portions. City Utilities has identified the piping material on the utility-owned portion. However, we need your help identifying your water service line material. It may be made of copper, lead, galvanized steel, or some form of plastic. The purpose of the regulation is to identify any lead or galvanized surface lines, as those materials, under some conditions, have the potential to release lead into the water passing through them. To identify your piping material, first locate your water service line, typically located in your crawl space, basement, or garage. If you can't find it, go outside and walk the shortest path from the water meter to your home. That's where the pipe will likely enter the house. Now, go inside and find the pipe. Next, locate the section of the pipe between the shutoff valve and the wall. If you don't have a shutoff valve, look for a transition from one type of material to another and then find the part of the pipe closer to the wall. If that portion of your plumbing system is PVC or plastic, take a photo and submit it via the electronic form found at www.cityutilities.net slash LCR. If it's metal, there are two simple tests you can do to identify the material. You will need a strong magnet to complete the test, such as one from your refrigerator. Put the magnet on the pipe between the wall and the valve, or the part of the pipe closest to the wall. If it sticks, your pipe is galvanized steel. A magnet will not stick to lead, copper, or PVC. Please take a photo of the magnet stuck to the material and submit it via the electronic form found at www.cityutilities.net slash LCR. If the magnet doesn't stick, move on to the second test. Grab a coin and carefully scratch the pipe in the same location where you stuck the magnet. Lead will scratch easily, revealing a shiny silver color beneath. If your pipe reveals a copper or golden color when scratched, it is likely made of copper or brass. Be sure the pipe is not painted when identifying the pipe type. Take a photo of the scratched off portion of the pipe and submit via the electronic form found at www.cityutilities.net slash LCR. Thank you for helping us safeguard our community's health. By identifying the material of your service line, you're taking a crucial step towards protecting our drinking water for generations to come. Your contribution not only ensures a safer environment for all, but also empowers us to build a healthier, more resilient community together.